Welcome dear friends. Usually when I open Notepad++, I get all my unsaved files as it was. But all of sudden today, I just see an empty tab and all my files disappeared. Luckily, I managed to recover all my files. In this video I'm going to show you, how to recover missing Notepad++ files. Method 1, Notepad++ Default Backup Folder. In your Notepad++, please select Settings. Go to Preferences. Choose Backup. Session Snapshot and Periodic Backup. This feature is enabled by default in all Notepad++ installations. Please double check that these two checkboxes have been enabled for you. Over here you can get the backup folder path. Sometimes this path is not explicitly provided here. If that is the case for you, then these are some of the most common places where you should look for your backups. Navigate to the backup folder. Or if you have copied the folder path, please use run to open it directly. Once you are in the backup folder, preferably sort by date. Now please open the files one by one, and you should get your lost files. Method 2. Other system locations. Please check if the file that you lost is available in Recycle Bin. If it is, then please drag and drop the file to your desktop. Right click on Start and select Run. Now please type percentage app data percentage. And hit Enter. In this search box search star.your file extension, in my case star.txt. Sort by date and look for your lost file. Please do the same for percentage temp percentage. And finally, follow the same steps for shell colon recent. Method 3. File recovery software. Well, there are many free apps available in the market. I generally use Recuva or Disk Drill. Remember, once you have decided to recover lost data from a partition, you should stop creating or copying any files to that partition. These actions may override your lost files permanently, and the chance of recovering your file will further go down. Please download and install Recuva. I have provided the download links at the end of the video description. Once installation is done, please launch the app. Select Next. If you're sure of the file type you can choose, or else please select all files. Please choose the specific drive or location. First I recommend you to try without this deep scan option. If the regular scan did not get you your lost file, later you can relaunch the application and do one more scan with this option enabled. Please choose the file. Then select Recover. Now you can choose the path, the location where you want to place the recovered file. And here is the file that I needed. I hope this video helped you. If you have any questions, please add your comments below, I'll respond to you. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done already. Thank you so much for watching.